In this nugget, we will look at positive and negative velocity. Velocity is an object's speed in a given direction. Velocity is measured in metres per second. Velocity is a vector quantity as it has a magnitude and a direction. What is the velocity of the space rocket? The rocket has a speed of 7,800 metres per second but it has a velocity of 7,800 metres per second to the right. As velocity is a vector, it requires a direction too. Therefore, the velocity is 7,800 metres per second to the right. The speed of the rocket is 7,800 metres per second. To determine the velocity of the rocket, we must give it a direction. We can use positive and negative signs in addition to a vector to describe the direction of motion relative to other objects. Let's draw some axes and make sure they intersect on the rocket. We now need to pick and label which directions will be positive and which directions will be negative. It doesn't matter which way around you pick, as long as motion to the left and to the right have opposite signs to each other and motion upwards and downwards have opposite signs to each other too. So I am going to pick motion to the right hand side to be positive. This means that as movement to the left hand side is in the opposite direction, movement to the left hand side must be negative. I am also going to pick movement upwards to be positive. This means that as movement downwards is in the opposite direction, movement downwards must be negative. Remember, it is really important to identify which sign convention has been used. It may well be the opposite to what has been shown here. The rocket is moving to the right, and so it has a velocity of plus 7,800 metres per second. The vector shows the direction. It is often seen that the positive sign is not shown and can be ignored. The rocket is now moving to the left and so it has a velocity of minus 7,800 metres per second. Pause the video and see if you can identify the velocity of the rocket. The rocket is moving upwards, and so it has a velocity of plus 7,800 metres per second. Well done if you got this correct. Let's have one more go. Pause the video and see if you can identify the velocity of the rocket. The rocket is moving downwards, and so it has a velocity of minus 7,800 metres per second. Well done if you got this correct. The number represents the magnitude of velocity, which is essentially the object's speed. If a sign is provided in front of the number, it can indicate the direction an object is travelling relative to other objects in motion. If a vector is provided, it represents the direction an object is travelling and indicates the magnitude of velocity. Remember, the size of the vector indicates the magnitude. Killian suggests that both of the spacecraft have the same velocity. Abida suggests that the speed of the spacecraft is the same, but the velocity is different. Who is correct? Pause the video to think about this, and play the video again when you're ready to check your answer. Abida is correct. The spacecraft are travelling at the same speed of 7,000 metres per second, but they have different velocities because they are travelling in different directions. This is indicated by the positive and negative signs in front of the number. OK, so to summarise. Speed and velocity are different quantities. Velocity is the speed of an object in a given direction. Velocity is a vector quantity as it has a magnitude and a direction. 
the velocity of an object can sometimes be stated using a positive or negative sign. This gives an indication of the direction the object is travelling relative to other objects. Keywords Magnitude, the scientific term for size. Quantity, an amount or a measurement of something. Relative, in comparison to. Scalar, a quantity that has a magnitude only. And vector, a quantity that has a magnitude and a direction.